Hello and welcome to Aaron's Tech Review and Tips. My name is Aaron Johnson and this is the One Minute Tech. Today we're going to be talking about the U.2 connector versus the M.2 connector. Which one is the better choice for you when buying a new motherboard? Which one should you choose when you get that new motherboard? Should you look for the new U.2 connector that only Intel 750 series SSDs can connect to? Or the old M.2 that everyone on the planet is making product for? This is what the connector looks like on today's modern motherboards. It is a max theoretical transfer speed of 32 gigabits per second. It utilizes the PCIe Gen 3 X4 transfer protocols. This is what the M.2 connector looks like on today's modern motherboards. It also uses the PCIe Gen 3 X4 transfer protocols and is the same speed as the U.2 at a theoretical max of 32 gigabits per second. So if they're the same speed and they use the same protocol, which one of them has the advantage? I think this one picture has to say it all. The M.2 PCIe Gen 3 X4 has the ability to be many things. It can change as your system's needs change as well. It can be a Bluetooth connector, a Wi-Fi connector, an SSD connector, or you can even change it into a U.2 connector. Add in the fact that costs, the M.2 price and manufacturer selection keeps your prices down on the cards that they produce, saving you cash. So, who is the winner? The clear winner has to be the M.2 Gen 3 X4 connector. It is what you need in your next motherboard. For today and tomorrow, future-proofing your investment. I have to give this a thumbs up. If you found this video helpful, please subscribe. And until next time, this is Aaron's Tech Tip and Review. This is One Minute Tech.